Okay, so uh, now this method is extremely easy to use and I think it uh, may be the easiest method to animate faces in Moon Animator. It may not be the best method, but it is uh, the easiest. Uh, now, the what you see in front of uh, you is a face pack that I use. Uh, so, a quick disclaimer, I, none of these faces were actually made by me. They're gathered from a bunch of other different random packs, and I just chose my fair of ones that I would find useful when uh, making videos. So, your uh, link to this one is going to be in the description, or you're free to use any other face pack out there. This will work with any face pack. So, yeah. Uh, let's begin. Uh, over here, uh, you're gonna. It will also come with a pack. There's gonna be head. So what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to set the transparency of the head to one, and we're actually gonna put it on our character over here. Um, actually, your character would look something like this. Yeah, your character would look something like this. He would have a face decal on him. So we want to put this onto his head. So what you're gonna want to do. Is you're gonna wanna go to the head of the character over here and you're gonna wanna go down to position and copy the position by clicking Control C and then going over here to the phase decals or the invisible head and pasting it into its position so we are would erase the posi current position of it and we we'll paste the position of his head so now that it's on his head you may see that it looks a bit weird and that's because we still have the old decals from his face on his head. So what we're gonna wanna do is you wanna go over here to head and inside of head there will be a decal named face or just, I don't know, there will be just any decal, Just you would just delete it like that. So yeah, now this looks a lot better but uh, the only problem is that it's not yet actually animatable. So let's uh, get that rigged right now really quickly. You're gonna want to take the face decals and you're gonna want to drag them into the head. This way it will just make it easier for us. Next you're gonna open up Easy World and then you're gonna select the head and then the face decals and you're gonna click join in place. Okay so um, yeah. Now if we go over here and open it in Moon Animator, I already have made an animation. I'm gonna open him, and uh, we can see that the face decals stay with him, and they actually move. The only, uh, just one more thing I want to mention is that if you click like in front of his face, not like you can click like behind on the sides, but if you click just like on like that on his face then the, the decals are gonna move and yeah so just so that you know uh, before animating uh, now how do we actually make his face change so uh, we're gonna click this little plus sign over here in moon animator and we're gonna go over here to the character's head we're gonna go to face decals and then you're gonna select eyes and mouth. Oops, I didn't need to do that. Eyes and mouth, and then you're gonna uh, check texture and you're gonna click OK. It will now add these two tracks onto into Moon Animator. And you can add keyframes to these by click uh, by selecting them and clicking plus on your number pad. This will add a keyframe for the for the face. Now, uh, how do we actually, you know, change the face? So, I'm gonna paste another keyframe for the mouth by clicking plus on your number pad. And we're gonna go over here to the mouth decals and I'll just make him unhappy because let's see, he had a bad day today. You would uh, double click on the face, so it was, you would double click it like this. And then it will open up properties. And over here where it says texture, you would select it and you would uh, click Control C. And then um, now that you did that, you're gonna go over here to this uh, keyframe. You're gonna click seven on your number pad and it will open up this menu. You're gonna go over here to value and then you're gonna remove whatever you got over here and paste the uh, texture of the new face. As you can see, 
His face has now changed and he became unhappy. Yep, see? Now he is unhappy. Um, there's another cool trick I can show you is uh, when he be when you would change the face, you could also make him blink. So we could just go over here. We are gonna copy the ID of this these eyes. And then we're gonna go add a keyframe for the eyes and you would just paste it in just like that. And then Yep, so see, uh, you would, you'd want to drag the eyes bef a bit before he changes his face, so it would look something like this. Actually, I think it would be better if we put the opened eyes. Yeah, well, you can really play around with this, you can make him blink. See? Like he's blinking. Yeah, and this is just a very basic and easy to use method. Uh, that's what I use for any of my own projects. And uh, yeah, the link to this is going to be in the description if you want to use it. And yeah.